Yo, 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 what's going on at the fight world? It's your boy Money back with another one, fam. And this one here is on Canelo Alvarez, Dominate Jaime Garcia to remain undisputed at the super middleweight division, holding on to all his titles. First of all, let me get a shout out to Jaime Garcia for being a tough competitor on Cinco de Mayo, going out there in front of all his fans, standing up strong, giving Canelo a strong battle in front of his family. You know what I'm saying? I salute Jaime Garcia. You know, this is his first loss. If I'm not mistaken, he's 43 and 1 now. You know what I mean? You know, he young. Still got a bright future ahead of him. Just ran into, ran into you know, the better man in the killing, Canelo Alvarez. We all know what Canelo is. Shouts out to Nello, baby. Shouts out to Nello, baby. Dropped Jaime in the fourth round. Um, smart in the ring. Um, you know, Jaime was trying to use his jab and things of that nature, some things that Freddie worked on, but um, it, it didn't work tonight. You know, it didn't work tonight. Canelo was the better man. And, you know, Canelo is still that guy and shows why he is the face of boxing, bringing out everybody. You understand? I repeat, bringing out everybody to watch him fight on the same day as tanking um, Frank Martin do they you know they press conference, you know, today June 15th fight which is a smart move to do it on Nello Day. But shouts out to Canelo, man. Shouts out to Canelo, man. You know what I mean? Worked the body, went upstairs, gave a very entertaining fight. I know a lot of haters out there going to be hating, saying, well, Canelo didn't stop him. You know what I'm saying? Canelo getting old, he's slowing down. This, that, and the third. Look, you ain't going to stop everybody, man. You ain't going to stop everybody. Canelo got enough stoppages in, 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 in his, um, you know, on his resume for him to be okay, but he dropped everybody leading up to then. Everybody he fought, he dropped. You know what I'm saying? So he didn't get the stoppage tonight, but it's A-OK, -okay, man. He feeling good. He looking good. You know, he move on to the next. You know what I'm saying? He move on to the next. But I enjoyed this fight tonight, man. Very entertaining. Like I say, Canelo go out there, and, and he know how to give a fans, well, get the fans, you know, a, 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 a show for their money. You know what I'm saying? He don't rob nobody. He don't go out there and, and, and half step or half ass. He go out there and he bang it out. And that's why he picked the young hungry line like Jaime Garcia who go push him, right? Because that's what Jaime did. Jaime pushed Canelo, being tough, rough, and rugged. You know, like I say, on Cinco de Mayo, you in front of all your people. You just don't want to go out like that. So I knew Jaime was going to come. I knew he was going to bring it. I knew he was going to be tough. You know what I mean? Um, my prediction was I thought Canelo would get a stoppage around the eighth or the ninth round. Like, I keep it real. I thought Canelo would have stopped him. I thought he would have threw more body shots and, you know, call Jaime upstairs and broke him down, things of that nature. But Jaime was tough, man. He was, he was tough and got to give him his just due. You know what I'm saying? I respect everybody that stepped inside that square circle, no matter if I joke about a fighter or, or whatever the situation is, you know what I'm saying? You have to give him his just doing his credit. You know, he's still strong against a, a, a powerful fighter in Canelo. You feel me? So, you know, the big question is what's going to be next for Canelo? You know, that's what everybody going to want. A lot of people going to say, well, man, you know, he ain't knocking nobody out, man. David Benavidez to do this and David Benavidez to do that. That's why I want Canelo to fight David Benavidez. You know what I'm saying? I want him to fight him. But, you know, Canelo have options. He has options, and people got to respect that. We got to see what's next for him. Um, David Benavidez got a hell of a fight coming up, but we got to see what's next for Canelo Alvarez. You no, know, Canelo, he going to take his time. Um, he just got a big time win. He going to enjoy this victory. Like I say, Cinco de Mayo, all the people out there, it's a lot that he's going to do right now. You know, he's going to enjoy this with his family. And I feel like nobody still is his pride and his joy, which I understand. Once you get to this level in boxing, you don't have to worry about bigging nobody up or worrying about um, who's next for you for us Canelo. You know what I mean? For us Canelo. But for us, the people, right, the people always want next. And they always want to see what you're going to do next. Would it be bigger and better than what you just did? Or, you know, would it be on the same level? So, you know, that's what it is. But with Canelo Alvarez, man, like I say, he had a stage now to where he does what he want to do. A lot of people going to be pissed off and mad about that. But you can't be, right? He earned his right to do what he want to do. And it's just a fact of the matter, bro. The nature of the beast in boxing is you whip people that they say you can't beat. Once you get to that stage, then look, you going to move how you want to move. You get the A side, and once you're holding on to it, as long as you're doing good shit with it, um, nobody can be pissed off at you, man. You know, So Canelo Alvarez, man, look, I, I know the fans booed a little bit once they asked about um, Benavidez, but then Canelo got him right back. 
You know what I'm saying? Because that's what he do. That's who he is. And, you know, we're going to see what's next for the king, man. But right now, congratulations to him. Like I said, I don't want to rain on – I don't do this to no fighter. Once you get a big-time victory, then look, to me, you got two weeks to enjoy yourself, bro. At least two weeks to three weeks to enjoy yourself. But Canelo, by him being the king and doing what he want to do, Canelo will have a month or two to enjoy himself, you feel me, until he pick his next opponent to see what it is, fam. So, shouts out to Nello, man. He did his thing versus Jaime Garcia. Once again, shouts out to Jaime Garcia. Hold your head high, young king. You know, you will be back. You lost to an all-time great. You shared the ring with an all-time great on Cinco de Mayo, right? So, you always going to go down in history for that. So, you know, it's going to hurt a little bit. It's going to sting a little bit because you lost. And you a winner. You never lost before. So, hold your head high. You feel me? Hold your head high. For Canelo, we'll see what's next. But we know the, the main question going to be, David Benavidez, David Benavidez, David Benavidez. We know that's what it's going to be, bro. So, shouts out to Nello once again. You the big dog. And um, let's see what's next, man. Y'all subscribe to Money Brown TV, man. Show me some love. Y'all know what it is. I'm on to the next.